I'm Trevor Nash from the Norfolk Beekeepers Association. The life cycle of a bee in the colony here, the queen lays an egg and after uh, three days that egg hatches and it becomes a larvae. And then after 21 days uh, it hatches into an adult bee. And it's quite, it works very hard right from the point of emergence. One of the first jobs it has to do is uh, to clean the cell out. And from there on, uh, it becomes a nursemaid bee. So after they've spent some time, about a week or two, inside the hive, they start to venture out from the hive. They will travel up to three miles from their home hive here uh, to gather nectar and pollen from the various plants. One thing about the honeybee is they specialise in the foraging aspect. So they may find perhaps a, a field of oilseed rape. Uh, what they will do is they will bring that nectar back to the colony here and uh, they will do a little procedure which they'll identify what they've gathered to the rest of the bees. They will pass the nectar through to them so they know a little bit of what the, uh, uh, the nectar is from the flowers that they've gathered it from and they can be very precise in the, the location of that field. Um, so what they do is they do a little dance. The more vigorous the dance, the more abundance of the, uh, of the nectar that they've found. And they can pinpoint the direction from the hive with relationship to the sun. We have two other cast of bees in there as well. We have the queen, who is the mother of all of the, of the, of the bees. And she can live up to about three to four years. The male bee, which is the drone, that's only prevalent in the colony uh, from spring through to autumn. At the end of the summer, uh, their requirement isn't used anymore. They, they, the only uh, object of them is, of course, is to mate with the queen. They don't want uh, any extra mows to feed through the winter, and so they are uh, put out uh, in, at, uh, usually by about uh, mid to end of, of uh, September. Find inspiring lessons, ideas and planning at developingexperts.com.